In spring boot, dependency injection can be achieved through constructor injection and field injection. Let's deep dive into each approach and discuss why constructor injection is often preferred over field injection. Constructor injection. Constructor injection involves injecting dependencies into a class through its constructor. Dependencies are passed as parameters to the constructor, and Spring resolves these dependencies and injects them when creating instances of the class. Field injection. Field injection involves annotating class fields, with auto-wide annotation or similar annotations, to inject dependencies directly into the fields. Spring initializes these fields and injects dependencies during bean initialization. Why constructor injection is preferred? Promotes better design principles, constructor injection encourages following best practices such as dependency inversion and solid principles, leading to more maintainable and testable code. Better readability and understanding, constructor injection explicitly declares dependencies in the class's signature, making it easier to understand the class's requirements and dependencies. Compile time safety, constructor injection helps catch missing dependencies or misconfigurations at compile time, reducing the risk of runtime errors.